All right, welcome back everybody. Today I'm going to uh, do a little product review over a Scotty's rod holder. Um, this is probably the most common rod holder that you can find. Pick them up for right around anywhere from $15 to $25, depends on the merchant you go through. But um, just kind of give you an overview of it out of the package here. The package is very nice. Just your simple plastic tells you the different things it can do and the different accessories that you can purchase to go with it. But uh, the rod holder itself is made of this very hard, about a quarter inch thick plastic. Does This model has a rubber strap. They have another one that locks by twisting it with the plastic piece. But to, uh, to undo this, just pull on it, allow you to slide your rod right in there, and then you can just fasten it right back. So that's how it holds your rod in. If you leave your rod on top here with the reel across the center right here for bait cast, it has a small slit in the bottom there for um, spinning rods but um, I found with most light to medium weight rods it will it will hold them just fine once you get into the more of the heavier weight a little bit more thick in diameter rods it'll have trouble of um, sliding in <clears throat> but uh, the mount here is, is pretty standard all it is is a, uh, a little locking feature inside of there that has a little peg that sticks out and that allows it to slide in and then twist and then you can compress it to uh, lock it in there We'll see if I can do this with one hand to separate it. Now it's pretty locked in there, pretty tight right now. But um, overall, to adjust the angle, all that you need to do is twist this right here, this little knob. And once you loosen it up enough, you'll be able to uh, separate the two pieces where you can adjust the angle that you would like to use. Once you have it where you like it, you just tighten it right back up. And it locks it fairly good in place um, I have used these for saltwater and freshwater fishing and uh, just make sure that whenever you mount it to your kayak if you can get underneath on the inside and use stainless steel screws with washers on the back side and locking lock nut, uh, excuse me locking nuts and that will prevent it from uh, stripping the screws out and being broken off or anything like that but uh, there you have it this is the Scotty's bait caster or spinning caster rod holder and um, if you're wondering what number part number this is, it's number 280, made by Scotty's. Thank you for watching.